Hello everyone, welcome to a first look video of the King Bank Sharp Blade DDR5 um, memory kit. These are dual channel kits, but I do have two of them. So here's the box itself. Opening it up. It also has a low cast timing of CL32, which is quite low for a 64,000 MHz RAM kit. This comes from China. I actually I picked this, I picked it up from AliExpress. Um, it's a relatively new brand. They haven't been around for too long. That means that you can get a great price. Um, it's actually a bargain compared to other brands out there that make, that make RAM and the SK Helix um, A RAM chips that they have on is one of the best in the industry as well so you should be getting the same quality um, obviously not there isn't much reviews out for these kits but um, I took the chance on this one um, price was really good so um, I installed all four DIMMs into the uh, into the motherboard and it booted it turned on I went into the BIOS and um, this is where I I turned on the Expo profile. Um, there's only one profile, so the, officially the um, RAM says it supports Intel XMP, but there's also an AMD X, um, Expo profile there as well. So um, I went into the BIOS and I I, I turned it on. This was for uh, 6,400 megahertz. On the BIOS, I also changed the um, AMD 5 Inf um, Infinity Fabric to 2200 MHz and changed the UCLK equals MEMCLK. Um, I've, I've heard that should give me a 1 to 1 ratio, so I, um, for if I'm running the uh, memory at 64000 MHz. So I, I did all of that, but with uh, 4 DIMMs installed, the system it, it, it just wouldn't boot. Um, I waited about 10 minutes as well, I tried it twice after clearing the CMOS, trying again, but the system would, it just wouldn't, uh, it just wouldn't boot and on the motherboard I did have these debug LEDs as well and um, yeah, it was showing me uh, CPU fault, memory fault. Um, I'm not too surprised with that, um, I know with AM5 um, the memory controller is built into the CPU and other people have been having problems with it as well. Getting um, getting four DIMMs to run at the um, Expo profile is it's a bit challenging. Um, I'm not sure if it's the memory's fault or if it's the you know if it's the CPU, if it's the memory controller on there. I did update the um, BIOS on my MSI motherboard to the uh, latest version at the time of filming this. It was BIOS version 7D76VA9, which was released in December 2023. So it was. A very recent version of the BIOS and I still run into uh, run into trouble with that. Um, the system would boot if it was just four randoms um, installed running at I think the standard speed so the um, overclock profile was just turned off and it wasn't running at its rated speed but you know you're not going to buy RAM like this just to keep Expo or Intel XMP turned off. I suspect that um, on, you won't run into this problem on an Intel platform. Intel isn't really known for it, but um, I haven't tested that. Um, so what I ended up doing was I just yanked out two, the two additional sticks of RAM and then the system booted with only uh, two DIMMs installed. So um, this, these are running in dual channel, 32 gigabytes of RAM in total. And yeah, it, it ran just fine. Um, didn't do any intensive testing with it, but everything seemed okay. I did go into MSI Mystics as well, Mystic Lighting, to check if I can control the RGB, um, which I can. I, I changed that to green, I did the rainbow effect, I turned it off as well just to make sure all that was good and yeah, it, it, it worked fine. Um, I'm, I'm quite happy with the RAM actually. Um, yeah, it's, 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 a, it's a good price. Um, didn't take too long to arrive. I got this from AliExpress. I got this for a uh, for a startup that I'm working on. Um, it's called VirtuHub.com, V-R-T-U, Hub.com. So do check it out if you have time. It's going to be a platform for gamers, for tech reviews, and and esports as well. Um, 
loads of exciting things planned for all of that and I want to give a huge shout out to uh, Venus Protocol as well um, you can check them out at venus.io um, they awarded me a grant just to um, get things moving, get things going and these um, these RAM sticks were um, were bought using their I'm um, using their grant money. So um, yeah, a huge thank you to them as well. Be sure to check them out if you have time. Thank you for watching, and um, I've still got tons to get through. So um, I'll see you next time.